Hey y'all, subscribe to Kohati and like the video. What's good, YouTube? I ain't recording no intro, you feel me saying? So, you did your little video, you know what I'm saying? You know, youngin'. And yeah, just enjoy the video, man. Look, comment, show you fun, fun, just like director, enjoy the video, youngin'. I'm about to go down now. Okay, so step one, step back, two to the front, and two. If y'all don't hush your mouth, I gotta listen to one person. All right, so look, we gotta do this the right way, man. We getting the homecoming comedy show started. Salute to everybody up top that came late. Ah, uh -huh. all right. <laughs> Bitch, we was early. Stupid nigga. Two step forward. Oh, another step forward. What, wait a minute, y'all don't know what the hell y'all doing. Okay, all right. All right, one, two, three, here we go. One, back, 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 back. That's all that is. 
I'm in Louisiana, I get off the plane, they're like, what's up, man and fresh? I ain't no goddamn man and fresh. I said, I gotta lose weight. You know when you be gaining weight, girls, what they, they be, I like that weight on you. So I kept eating. <laughs> my mama didn't like my weight, so we got in an argument. She told me, get out the house, you big bitch. I said, hold on. <laughs> you said you like this shit. I ain't going back and forth with somebody built like finesse two times. Hold on. Y'all laughing at the wrong shit. Shut your ass up. Who out there were out? Any rappers in the crowd? No. Yeah, stop. I nigga focus on y'all work. But if you do rap, let your family know you rap. My cousin started rapping, but he ain't tell me. I get in the car, I said, cuz, who that bullshit? <laughs> so my cuz, that's me. I said, oh shit, start it over, cuz. <laughs> I didn't know you start rapping. I fought with that college shit. I tried it out. I did one year, then I dropped out. Well, I did one semester, then I dropped out. <laughs> college ain't for everybody, so if you in college right now, you doing your shit, stay in there and keep going hard, right, man. Real talk. I knew college went for me. As soon as I got to college, I went to the bookstore. Bought me an alumni tag to put on the car to show school spirit. My <laughs> walked up and said, you alumni, what year you came out? I said, I just got here. <laughs> they said, alumni mean you graduated. I started unscrewing the tag. I said, let me take my hand back home. Because I knew school was too much when they started putting alphabets in the mail. You feel me? All that X and all, hey man, take out fine X. No motherfucker, you fine. <laughs> now I gotta help my child with work. I got a high school kid. Damn. I don't know that shit because I didn't take it serious when I was in school. So now I just get mad at her when she asks me for help with her work. <laughs> she said, my dad, how to turn a mixed price into a whole number. I said, what the fuck you just say to me? <laughs> Cause you ain't listening to that goddamn teacher when you in the classroom. I got my shit, you better go get yours. I had to pull my phone out. How to turn a mixed fresh to a whole no. But then you gotta think about it. Think about college right now. Y'all remember those slow kids when we was in school? You remember the kids? Everybody can't do college work. Everybody can't read out loud. You remember in school when motherfuckers had to read out loud? You knew when they couldn't read because they started breathing hard. We gotta read a paragraph. If you see somebody do this, what? oh, they gonna fuck that whole paragraph up. They say that first word hard as hell. Duh. The decent, take your time, travel. <laughs> Nigga start talking to the book, huh? <laughs> Duh. The decent, remember your short E and your long E, Trevor. I'm like, it's the decision. Teacher talking about, now I'm not here, but bitch, you ain't gonna never get that word. He said, decent and decent. But if you can't read, they take you to a slow classroom. You know, there ain't too many people in there, and the teacher can work with your hands on. Be about six people in your classroom. My homeboy was in one of them classes. He was like, I'm in that class because I'm bad. I'm like, no, the fuck you're not. <laughs> you can't read. That's why you in that goddamn class. You need to... I know you. Anybody here from Atlanta? Okay. Yeah, she from Atlanta for real. She started throwing up gang signs back there. I'm fucking with it. Who not from Louisiana? Yeah. Ha, <laughs> ha,
Vegas. Mississippi, I said Mississippi. Woo! All right, it's somebody waving the light. I gotta know where the fuck they from. Where are you from? <laughs> <laughs> Sit your slow ass down. You know what I'm saying? All right, like, hey. Y'all done turned this shit into a Beyonce concert. Stop waving the light. All right, right now, where you from? Lie more. Yes. They just lie better. Yeah. 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 
I lie about shit, I ain't even supposed to lie about. Y'all always catch it, fellas. You ever get caught one of them dumbass lies by your girl? And now you gotta stand in like a battle rapper when it's the other nigga turn. What you see, man? What for? My mama. We'll never catch y'all lying. Y'all are so good. Y'all to start lying tonight about some shit you gonna do in 2026. That's how good y'all is. And all your friends know the plan because y'all tell wicked lies. Y'all tell wicked lies. Y'all tell lies to build a man's confidence up. So if he act like he ain't got no sense, you can get I lie like them too. These are the lies y'all tell. Oh, yes, daddy. Oh, my God, it feels so good, daddy. I'm in my stomach. You're in my stomach, daddy. Look at y'all laughing because you're in my stomach. You're in my stomach, daddy. You're so good. As soon as you leave, share that group chat, bitch. So, nigga might not know me, but I damn sure know y'all. So, I'm gonna walk the fuck out, and then I'm gonna come back on stage. And everybody that don't turn up, I'm on your ass. One more time, DJ Nell. Turn up, you gonna be on your ass. They do? Bulls, I swear to God, I heard them. Shout out to everybody who bathed before they came to this. Who are here fresh? I gotta tell the truth though, man. Y'all, y'all, young folks, y'all doing better. Y'all looking way less musty and way less dusty than you used to look. Y'all growing up, and I'm proud of you. Look at y'all with lotion on and shit. Well, not those two niggas, but the rest of y'all with lotion on and shit. Proud of you. Got on the older niggas on and shit. You got on a brand new outfit. This color, what you said? <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't speak stinky coochie. Oh, yeah. Now hush, my grown folks is talking, goddamn. Oh, it. It's homecoming, so y'all already know. There's gonna be a whole bunch of niggas on campus that you have never met, old as hell. Niggas like myself, old as hell. I graduated high school in 2003. Yeah, that's how old. That's how old I am, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. What, what you had said? You said, damn, I'm old as fuck. I tell you one thing they did back when I was in school, they picked they whole afro. Yeah, you said, yeah, yeah. Quit touching just the part you comb. Quit picking just the front of it. The back of it look like old carpet. Yeah, get that part. Yeah, I guarantee you got six ink pens in that bitch right now. Yeah, that shit balled up like an afro. Yeah, you got a strong black pap. Yeah, go go get a mirror and get the back end. Matter of fact, hand the pig to a friend and let her get that part. Yeah, because you could have been quiet. Now I'm going to tell your go-go boot wearing ass up. Yeah. You don't get your Rick James shoe wearing ass the fuck out of here. But when I was a young boy, growing up in the head of boots wearing ass, if you don't get your... That's what they know me for. Yeah. Yeah, anybody else got it on their heart, they see. Oh, okay. I can get back to the jokes. Well let the church say, well, all right then. What you had said over there in the dark, mustache the boy? Yeah, I got it all night. Come on down here. I got a hundred round drum. 
Y'all, no, don't do it from way up there. Don't be no hoe. Come down here where everybody can see. Yeah, play pussy and get fucked on. Don't do it to yourself. Huh? Huh, what you said? Yeah, your chin smell like dick meat, though. Where they do that at? Yeah, cut the spotlight up real hard on his Walmart t-shirt wearing ass. Fade it over and dress an ass, little boy. Come down here where everybody can see you. I'll do it all night. I swear to God, I will. Yeah. Gonna let y'all students that's gonna plan on graduating know one thing. You got to worry about who in your circle. Turn to your neighbor and say neighbor. Neighbor. Worry about who's in your circle. Worry about who in your circle, gang. Get niggas that's gonna fail the fuck out your circle. Wait, what do you think? You know who gonna fail? The nigga who done dropped half his classes already. You only been in school seven weeks. Yeah, that nigga, get him out your circle. That nigga who always come to your room hungry, but ain't never got nothing on the peanut butter jellies and the ramen noodles. Get him out your circle. The nigga who always got a back wheel, but no weed. Get him out your circle. Get him out your circle. And them people ain't gonna be who the people you need when you move on in life. Believe me, I'm wrong. I remember the seven people that I went to school with, and it was way more than seven of us on campus. Because them was the only niggas that did something with their life. Get still bump, this big ass dude standing behind me. Now I'm a grown man. So I apologize like a grown man. I said, my bad, big dog, excuse me, and I walked off. But behind me, he said, you better watch where you're going, bitch. Oh, I was like, what, nigga, you want to run that by me again, big ass nigga? He said, you heard me. Watch where you're going, bitch. Now, I walked in the store, zero bitches. I ain't going to leave two of his bitches. Hell no. I like say, big ass nigga. I ain't never been nobody bitch, you understand me? And if we got a problem, well then come see me. And I told my face up. It's usually that work. That nigga said, well what you wanna do? What you wanna do? Now you loud talking me and you done call me two bitches, line it up. So I got mine together. And he cocked his hand way up in the air like this. And I'm willing to admit I ain't never seen nothing like that before. So I looked up to see what it was, nigga brought it down real hard. Hit me in between my eyebrows right here. If you ever got hit with this part of the hand all across this, nigga, I was woozy. I was dizzy. I ain't gonna lie. He didn't stomp me. He stomped me. I caught myself. I stood up and nigga had a brand new one waiting on me. Bow, hit me in the same fucking spot. I'm drunk at this point, so now I gotta tackle him. I gotta stabilize his body. But it's three of his ass. So I'm trying to pick which nigga I'm gonna go for. And for some reason, that nigga got that hoe ready again. And I don't know why I looked up, but I did. He brought that hoe back down. So I just blew the safety whistle until his chaperone came to get that nigga up off of me. You gotta know when you done lost. But I took that nigga move. That's what you do when you lose a fight. You take what they did to win, you add that to your repertoire. You fuck with me now, I get that hoe ready for your forehead. I don't play no games. I'm 12 and 0 since that one. I don't even count that as no loss. He had special needs. He was super strong. That nigga was retarded, dumb strong. That nigga hit me with the, with the fist of God. Nigga got my life together. I stole that shit. You fuck with me now, nigga? I ain't playing no games. Police had me scared, made me throw all my weed out before I got on campus. Just to get on campus, and it smelled loud than a motherfucker all around campus. I seen one of the young niggas. I said, hey, what's up, young nigga? Come here. He said, what's up, um? I said, shit. I don't need that gas, nephew. I need that pressure. Ain't that what the young kids call? I need that pressure, goddamn it. Where is that? I know you got it. He said, shit, I got the three, five going for the bank for the bitty. I say, for the bitty? He said, yeah, OG, I, it's hard out here. I need the bitty. I say, well, go on, get your phone out, young nigga. He reached down, got the phone. He looked up, I had that already for his phone. He was playing with me, hard at him. Sell me $22 a week for $50. I'll put the police in your life. Who you lying to? BET with her own shows, a couple of She's a judge, she's a mother, she's a gangster, she's a, she everything, but she here tonight to perform for Southern at the homecoming, so especially my ladies, my black women, I need y'all to make some motherfuckers, I need everybody to make some noise, I need my black women to make some motherfucking noise for the
Enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? Youngin. <laughs> Anything. Like the video right now. I'm going to give you five seconds. I'm going to give you five seconds. Three, two, one. Boy, if you ain't like the video, boy, you a hoe. And I'm just going to go.